Onivia. League of Legends highlights. Powered by ArcaneBet.com. Bet live on eSports. Jarvan ends up going as Gragas is the final lock. I kind of I like Gragas in this situation, to be honest with you. It should be going in the jungle, and J J4 will then go top lane as a result of this. Now, the reason that I like Gragas... Doing these at risk. Here comes Swift. Steps forward. Flash, body slam, red buff, but flashes out of the flick from Coco. Shinyi will get into the lane. Whoa. Flash, auto for the damage. They know he's got no escape. First blood, Shinyi. And a good counter gang coming from the cave. JD, they're looking for Sky. Akabe has to be the initiator. Coco's already heading out on this side of the map. The March of the Ends goes forward as they tag him down and dive under the turret. But Coco is right there. Kabe's tanking a few hits. And that's the quick turnaround. Sky locked in. Umbral Trespass. Ooh, sidesteps the knockup, but still will drop down. Coco gets the first kill for Newbie. From Doinby and Kabe, one in front and one from behind. But here comes the Maokai. Don't you wish he had his ultimate, though, as they flash in Gage and bounce hounds LWX. He heals, he survives, but finally dies. Meanwhile, Doinby on the side is keeping the tanks separated. He's up there, that's oh, Teleport no. right behind him. But it's Loken who's going to walk into the tank along with Shinyi. Sky steps forward. He's taking a lot of damage, but concussive blows locked down. Shinyi gets the kill. Kabe still flanking. Has LWX separated is and dead. killed LWX. A double kill for Shinyi. 21. Oh, it's Baron time. Oh, no. No, don't do it. Kragas <laughs> is still <laughs> alive. They're doing it. And they are going to try to make this happen here. Barrel over the wall. Kabe in steps into tank. In of the Gragas. I don't know. Weaver's wall is again denied by Mao. He is on point with these unbreakables, but very low health. Doinby and Loken have got to finish this off. 3,000 health. Two and a half. This is as 50-50 as you'd like on this Kabe's a miracle worker. Kabe's over the wall, but it's Swift who goes in and steals the Baron. Shinyi is dead, and it's the cleanup from the outside as Coco lands another kill onto Mao. Ah, dumb. Live or die by your decisions, <laughs> JD. You know what? They... Gosh, it's just so crazy to me that knockup yeah, lasts so long. As Tank it off. Kabe is now trying to fight Sky. Shinyi chases him down. Lands the max range knockup and chases on. Mao in the mid lane takes a hit. Oh, and makes it out of the range. Meanwhile, Weaver's Wall not going to be canceled this time. They've dived onto him <laughs> and they've killed Shinyi and haven't lost anyone yet, but they might be losing the turret. Up with here. a flank just from being there. And this is the correct move from Nubi. They might lose the turret, but if they wide their time well enough, they don't waste the J4 teleport and get the engage after, then they've got the opportunity. Yeah, they found Doinby, the flash cast. He flashes away, but ace in the hole. They're tagging onto Sky in the back line, but tank for hyper carry, definitely not worth. No one's protecting Loken, and LWX steps forward to remind him who is the alpha 80 carry here. The Even rest in the game is a mid lane out up. Baron worth a lot more for the side of Nubi, otherwise they're not breaking structures. And this has played out very elegantly from this side. Yeah, Weaver's Wall from Coco to deny anyone from approaching. The only person who was getting close was Mao. Sees the wall, turns around, goes back home. Baron picked up for the second time. It channels faster. I don't know, I guess Dad has to say teleport before I can do it. <laughs> Again, they're running out of time. Flash knockup onto LWX they're going. and the exhaust. And another one, Redemption, plus the Umbral LWX Trespass. Is dead. He's dead. Doinby locks him down. Loken and Doinby in the back. They're going to have to turn onto Sky as the tanks in the front chase it away. Moore walks past the Weaver's Wall as Kabe. He teleports independently this time and comes up huge, locking down another one. Mao has found Sky, but Doinby did die Mal. to him. And the moment that Kog'Maw oh. shows up. That's only because if Noobie get this, it might be game over. But if JD get it, Shin things change. They certainly do. Weaver's Wall separates Kabe from the rest of his team, and Shinyi is in the pit. He gets a knockup. They chase away. it forward. The Dragon resets. It's at 3,000 health. Redemption keeps the tanks up so healthy. Loken and Doinby are still firing in the back. They've got Sky out of it. The Dragon is still alive. Meanwhile, the Umbral Trespass means that Shinyi oh, gets it. to reset, and he steals the Elder Dragon for JD. But it's too many carries. They're in the brush. The Sweeper spots them, but here comes the damage. Loken flashes Loken. in, and he's doing the damage. He finally goes down as LWX retreats oh. with his life. Just kidding, he dies. Doinby versus Swift and <laughs> Sky. Can he hold down the fort? And Doinby, the one man. And hello, that's the Drake. And that's really a mistake from Newbie. They shouldn't be hitting the Drake. 
if there is a Guardian Angel about to come back up and available. So. he's going for the Baron. Of course he is. Oh, it was secured by Swift, but here's just that huge play. Loken, after being at a deficit nearly the entire game, actually the entire game. And of course, note the Elder Dragon is enough to actually secure that buff, yeah. uh, that kill, by doing extra burn damage as he was running at him as a dead waddle in yep, Cogmore. Yep. The Akathian surprise. Sky, no! Oh, he got away from the Baron, but chased into the red buff. And things we have to note is in the bottom of your screen, he's right there somehow, and, and that's it. That's tough. JD, Whoa. they've started Baron. They have. They're they've doing this in vision. The timer is actually ticking away. They've got minions top, they've got minions bottom. Could they be forcing a fight here? They get it low, swift over the wall, but it's no. picked up by Shinyi. Cask separates it. Oh, they're Kabe engaging. with the engage. They've got Coco and he's dead. It's LWX in the back kiting it out, but Loken flashes the trap line, chases forward onto Swift with the rest of JD and LWX. He's, he's in sped trouble. up. But he's caught by the Winter's Bite. Look at the damage Doinby does. Kills him immediately as the two carries of Newbie are dead. And that quick swift intermission, of course, for Doinby as they continue pushing forwards here, Dom. Not just the inhibitor. What are you going to do, Newbie? They're pushing in. They're trying to close it out. JD. Drop one Nexus turret, turn to the second. But here comes the rest of Newbie. Do they have what it takes to keep themselves in it? Turns out the answer is no. JD take game number one over Rivals Newbie. An unusual way to start the night, to say the least, but JD, they just hold on. And they just keep on scaling. Newbie showing that with the lead, they...